Tokyo, where the military is maintaining a heavily guarded perimeter around the site of last month's terrorist attack. The Japanese government has stated that an unidentified radical political group released a biological agent in the Tokyo subway, less than one kilometer from Orochi Tower. Although the area has been evacuated, there have been eyewitness reports of activity inside the perimeter, including ongoing fighting between Orochi security personnel and armed civilians. Authorities are denying these reports, and the military has barred anyone from approaching within 100 meters of the temporary perimeter. You will see the end of days. You will see the dawning of a new age. To be a monarch or a beggar, to lose everything or to become a god, to stand with us or against us, the choice is yours. Remember this. Be mindful of the voices. Listen to the voices they that will whisper, whisper in your sleep. sleep. You are with the chosen, you are with but the you chosen, must choose for but you yourself. You must make the right choices. You are cursed with free will. You are cursed with free will. We are here to guide you to the light. It's not my place to intervene, but then this, Even if this is, is merely a dream. dream. Make the right Make choices. Make the right choices. And, and be, be mindful, mindful of, the, of voices the voices that whisper. They corrupt. For they speak the truth. Good afternoon. Are you... From the look of things, I guess that question is moot. B problem? There's a lot of that going around. I represent an organization headquartered in London. A very large organization with branches across the globe and connections in every government. Although we see ourselves as a... Um, a silent partner. We pull strings. Big strings. Prime ministers, presidents, kings. Dark days are coming. The world is in turmoil and we're recruiting. Soldiers, agents, adventurers, crusaders. And we offer good terms, a fresh start, a network unlike any other, unlimited resources, a fantastic medical plan, and a way to harness and use your incredible powers. It may be a big transition, but look at it this way. This is a unique opportunity. You have been chosen. You have been granted powers beyond what most can imagine. 
So you can either be an outcast in a world that will never understand or accept what you've become, or you can join others like you, take a stand against a rising darkness, and embark on a journey into the unknown, into the hidden places, into the secret world. The choice, as we're so fond of saying, is entirely yours. But know this, your emerging powers will attract plenty of attention, and not everyone is as, um, as accommodating as we are. On your own, you'll be easy prey. You might not last a week. This will get you where you need to go. There are instructions inside. Use it or don't use it, it's your prerogative. You won't see me again. I trust you'll make the right decision. By the way, our organization is called the Templars. You may have heard of us. We've been around a while. Good day. Sorry, can't let you through without authorization. Look, I don't know what that's supposed to be, but it's not... All right, lads. D.I. Shelley, they're with me. Do us both a favour and don't go flashing that letter around out here. The boys on the cordons haven't been briefed. As far as they're concerned, this is all just heightened awareness after the terrorist attack in Tokyo. But I don't deal with the bureaucracy. I deal with the truth about the secret London, about the Templars. I'd say... I hope you know what you're getting yourself into. But you have no idea. Even I only get as involved as I have to, for the sake of us little people. You've seen it on the news. The Tokyo incident. That's what happens when your new crowd lets things get out of hand. Not here. Not on my watch. That's the deal. That's always been the deal. You'll be safe inside, Eldwick. Go see one of the prophets prophesying up the road by the tube station. They'll fill you in on the kind of crazy you've got ahead of you. Best be prepared. My sincerest condolences. Too late to start recycling. <laughs> to go to raves to save the gorillas. To cash out those Anansi sheds. There's a storm coming. Mundo storm. Paint your glass houses shut! You don't have to take his word for it. This is a warning from the sun. It says it's old and tired and scared of death. It says you've lived as young gods for too long. Spoiled children who only need to wish for something and it'll come true. Well, those days are gone now and won't be here again. <laughs> Sorry! I'll show you how it all goes down, through the medium of unreliable narration. A vision of the future. This could be your lucky day. Tomorrow and all the ones after, not so much. It's a hot, wet day. You ever notice how the apocalypse always comes on a wet day? There's the smell of warm air and stale piss. The atmosphere is electric. I mean, actually electric. Sparking off the tracks, lifting and snapping your hair. A voice over the speakers that you don't hear. You itch. The black signal sounds. Lights out. Everything. From the park to, to a Rachi Tower. SDF quarantine. Good news for Tokyo, bad news for us. I thought the dragon thrived on chaos. Someone once told me the Illuminati had all the answers. They're saying a bomb. It's never just a bomb. Something worse. Something that brought the filth with it. So we fight. That's what us Templars do. I enjoy a good fight. It's just these trousers are bloody velvet. Sarah! Thank Gaia! Smartphones. I don't need smart, I need functional. 
I'm told you are about to rise in rank. That's all well and good, but I believe nothing of value comes for free. You have to show some backbone and commitment. You have to prove yourself. Please return to London at your earliest convenience. We have an assignment for you. Your earliest convenience would be at this very moment. Remember, all eyes are on us now, so... Shoulders You're back. moving up. This must be very exciting for you. Of course, in my day, it wasn't enough to put your nose to the grindstone. You had to be someone. Your family name had to be listed in the registry. You were expected to have history. The sort of history that matters. I suppose it's a sign of the times and the pickle we've found ourselves in that blood no longer carries quite as much cachet. Between the two of us... I'm not entirely sure I'd disapprove. We need you to go to Brooklyn. There's talk of the Illuminati dealing with the organized occult criminal elements in New York. We're told they've got their hands on something rather filthy. Look into it. I won't insult you with a please. We have received the coordinates for a meeting between the Illuminati representatives and the black market traders. It's in a car park of all places. The Illuminati have no sense of style, none at all. The boys in the computer department told me to tell you they are uploading the information to your telephone. Why we couldn't just tell you where to go is beyond me. When I was a field operative, I kept my journal in an actual journal. It appears you have arrived too late to intercept the agent before their meeting began. Never mind, you'll have to see to it that the meeting is interrupted. There is a security booth somewhere in the vicinity. There might be something of use in there. during the Great War. Miss Plimswood and I had to douse all the gaslights and make our way through a bunker in the dark. We combined two spells to create a makeshift sonar, saved us from falling into a bottomless pit and getting eaten by... But that's neither here nor there. Chop, chop! Now's the perfect opportunity to get your hands on the contraband merchandise. Thank you. 
This is interesting. The boys with their computers are running some sort of facial recognition program on the body. But I don't need them to tell me that this fellow isn't Illuminati. He is Phoenician. So, the Phoenicians are involved. This complicates matters. I'll have to discuss this with the Force Marshal. You can leave. You ought to, before you're swamped by more infected humans. There's nothing more to be accomplished for now. By foxes, you do not want to know what I just read in my tea leaves. Nice work out there. We have nothing more for you right now, so you should return to your previous assignment. I'll give you a ring the next time we require your services. Go on, I'm not the mothering type. This is as much praise as you'll ever get from me. To say you've done far better than expected is such a backhanded compliment, isn't it? 